my dudes, what's going on? If you want a chance to get your Eidolon account reviewed, make sure to head over to twitch.tv slash griffybit, make sure to follow and look for when I go live with account reviews in the title for your chance to enter the giveaway to get reviewed and end up on one of my YouTube videos. Anyways, let's get into it. We're taking a look today at Clash's Toxic's account. He needs help with overall damage. We're not going to take too look into his characters or his stats. We're going to take more look at how to help build it up a little bit more through cards, alchemy, and other means to see where he can go from there. So, to start off, let's take a look at his stamps. Of course, got to look at that, see it, see how it is. 46 to 86. What world are you on? Are you on world six? You are on world six. You do have science feather pen. Wow. Actually, for where you are in the game, you are really, really low. You're, you're all the way at leak spirits. And you don't, and you have 4,600 stamp level. Okay, right off the get go. Stamp level easily needs to be like 7,000. Honestly, these are these are super 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 low. Like you've hard neglected your stamps like crazy. You're missing a few stamps as well. You've neglected a lot, especially like crystalline stamp. Yo. Focus crystalline stamp. That's a big that's a big one. And also all all combat stamps. If you can if you could throw a combat stamp in it, do it. Do it. You need to. Absolutely. Hey, look at alchemy here. How? How? How are people in World 6 with this type of alchemy? It blows my mind. It literally makes my brain go... Why is this a thing? Oh my, okay, okay, so, bubbles to focus on, multiplier bubbles, okay, multiplier bubbles all the way, and you want to focus on bubble number six, which is going to be big meaty claws, quick slap and name, I guess. Now, the thing is, is these things won't give you huge amounts of damage, okay? But this is important because this is base damage. Although it's a small miniature amount, base damage will help scale your total damage percent. And that's what the main reason to get this up. But the, the biggest thing you're going to get is probably from Quick Slap, but, you know, it's still helpful in, in, the, in the long run. So it's definitely something you want to work on. As well as the, the these bubbles as well, you want to also hit up, if you can, where is it? Right here. Ridley Spears, Bojack, Matty Statford. Bohack, Bojack, and Matty Stafford. These one these ones are super, super, super good. Because you can get definitely a few percentage. Like you have 23% here, you're missing about 2% there, 2% there. And you you got that pretty close. You could get you could easily get like another six percent, six to seven percent from there, no problem. And also where are you you are missing a massive damage spike. You have 58, 49, 69. These three bubbles, try one, two, and three, are gonna be so big. I think in all these multiplier bubbles alone, everything here, I probably guarantee you could probably increase your damage about two hundred percent. 200% total damage probably from these in total. Or pretty close. Ma approx. I would say I would say approximately. Of what you could probably hit, I would say. If you if you if you actually got these to a certain percentage. Cause that because that's that's super huge for you. You're missing out on those big time. It is a lot of damage. You know you don't understand how, how much of a damage it is. If you're looking for a little bit of extra two, uh tail time is also huge. Tail time vile and crack and aid. If you can get those doing good, those are just extra weapon power. Super, super big. 
Sigils, I don't I don't want to see you worry about sigils right now. It's just something you just don't need to worry about. You need to push stuff. Everything looks good in that. Destruction. I mean that's for mostly for DK. What's your 3D print? Oh. 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 Huh. Okay, we're just gonna move on. Yeah, you're missing. Yeah, yeah. Oh my god. Do world. Do your. Time for eclipse skulls. This it, you're you're at this time where you can do all your eclipse skulls no problem. They're already at purple. You're at blurple. Push all the way through. That is so much damage. Unrealistic amount of damage. How's your shrines looking? 17, 15, 15, 15. Yeah, your shrines are fine. Equinox, you have matching skims yet? You have 13 out of 13 matching skims. That's great. That's awesome. That's what you love to see. Okay, perfect. Feet available, stick with step. Yo, rip, dude. Cooking, how's your cooking looking? You have so many, you have a crazy amount of, you need to, you need to, you need to level up some of your stuff here. Some of this is four minutes. That's like one ladle, one ladle, one ladle, one ladle. You got, you got a bunch of easy cook stuff you could do. You need to get that. You, Ooh, okay, so what I've noticed here. So this is this is this is what I've noticed here. This is a classic case of I'm going to rush to world six and ignore everything along the way. This is this is kind of rough. He has speed ran this game. Completely ignoring everything else. Do I dare look at trapping? I regret looking at trapping. Okay, on the plus side. How are you 72 on trapping and your other characters are 22? What are you doing? Okay. You need to set up all nature traps using transfusion with your V-man and get them all caught up. Like, this is crazy. Like, actually insane, bro. There should be no reason. You're gonna have to spend so much time backtracking. Okay, so that's one pack. That's two packs. That's three packs. Four packs. Five packs. Six packs. That's crazy. You're you're wilding, dude. You're actually wilding right now. Wait. Wait, why wait, why why are you running four defense chips on your boobo? Wait. This man's onyxing statues. Why are you trying to onyx statues at level 18? Am I... Am I having a fever dream right now? I feel like I'm in a simulation. I, I actually feel like my stream is bad for some people. Because it's like... 
people see me doing something and they're like, yeah, I should do that too. And then you see accounts like this and you're like, oh my God. Wait. 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 Why do you have two Beastmasters? I'm actually dreaming. This is actually a fever dream. Wake up, Griffy. It's time to wake up. Ah, funny, funny dream. Why are we running two Beastmasters? What's the reason for this? You made this count before seeing it. Okay. All right. You know what? Fine. If he likes it, he likes it. That's okay. Okay. He does do death storage though. That's fine. You know, that's fine. Oh, and he has two boobos. Oh, he has two boobos, two beast masters. Oh no. Oh no. Did he at least have his flurbos done? Okay, at least he got that done. Wait, hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on. He has no class swap tokens. No class swap tokens. That's a ripperoni. That's a ripperoni. Yeah, you say with 2k pounds? I mean, you know, it's not a big deal. So I would suggest, I strongly suggest in the limited time shop, grab two elite class swap tokens, swap your Beastmasters to Siegebreaker, swap your Boobo to Elemental Sorcerer. He doesn't, have, I see why he doesn't want to deposit statues. He's waiting for level 13 vials. So he can get 110%. He's at 32.4% right now. And you're waiting until... Wait. 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 You're waiting for statues to double up and you're only at 32%? Homie? Deposit. Your... Statues, except for Kachow. Do all of them except for Kachow. Let me cope. Brother man, you are missing out on a insane, insane amount of levels. And you can farm all of these again very, very, very easily. Because you probably don't even have the drop rate to even make a dent. But like... I would say don't need to Onyx. Like you already have the main ones, like food effect and stuff like that. Just, just, just drop them, man. Just 100% just drop them. There's no reason why you shouldn't. Like even like this one, like even the, 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 the damage percent one. You, 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 gotta, you gotta drop that, dude. You're missing on so much bonuses here. It's crazy. And also, you need to work on post office. Your, your post office is, is, is on its way. How, how are you doing on summoning? And the crazy part is, is you're cooking on summoning. You're absolutely cooking insanely. How's your divinity looking? You got everything but Badger? That's not bad. Good, you got one in Permi. Good. I'd like to see that. Your cooking needs love. Okay, you're missing out on the three lavatory blings. That's fine. Breeding. Seems like you're doing the breeding strat, which is good. Do I, do I check worship? Do I dare to check worship? Actually, your worships are better than I thought it was. 
Wait, actually. Wait, 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 hold on a second. Why is your worship so giga tier? And you've been running Luciferian skulls, but you've neglected trapping. This is crazy to me. You need to farm out Zerg Restrogen as soon as possible. Bro, brother, man, there are so many things that you need to work out other, other than, okay, so chat. Clash is a cl classic case. A classic case of just, just, just horse blind rushing. Okay. He just, he just went for it. He's like, I want world six. I want end game content. That's what I'm going to go for. That's what I'm going to roll with. That is exactly what Clash did. Now, is that wrong? No, it's not necessarily wrong. I feel like that's perfectly fine. If that's something you want to do. Sure. Why not? But you got to realize when you push this far, you are going to spend way too much time catch up because you're also oh time gated to an incredibly amount of things now. And that, that's, that's where you're going to start running into issues is the time gating because you're actually, your account is pretty well kept to be honest. But like, look, you're in world six with dementia gear with no tools, bro. Absolutely no tools. You're running, you're still running the silkskin traps. You're still running tier, tier one, tier one slicers. Like you're using cooking rings. You're just, you're, you're, you're seeming to like give a couple people some stuff and then everybody else falls short. So I would say get gear situated, get tools, at least void tools. Get splicers up. Silk skins are fine. But that's only, but you're using cardboard traps as your stats, as your stat stick. So no, it's, it's, it's not good. Silk skins are good if you have like the end game trap using skill skin to, uh, to, to get it. How's your obols? Your obols are actually pretty good. I'm actually not gonna lie. Your obols are not bad. Obols are a lot better than I thought they would be. This is going to give you more than enough time. This is what you need to work on. So. We started off with overall damage. This is not your problem. This is not your, your overall damage is the least of your problem right now. So what I want you to do is stamps levels easily need to be about 7k. And focus on crystalline stamp. That's a huge one. Start printing up boring bricks. All combat. When it comes to damage, you want your multiplier bubbles plus big meaty claws. Quick slap name, I guess. Those are small ones. They're only base damage, but they scale off total damage percent. That's going to be a huge one. And then go Britley Spears, Bojack, Matty Stafford is your damage percent, and then try one, try two, and try three is your damage stuff based off your main stat. You'll get, if you do all this with the, with the approximate bubbles you have right now, it'd be like 200% total damage, okay? You want to focus on Tail Time, Vial, and Krakenade. These will give you weapon power, and also will start stacking with your Vial Mastery. You're ready for Eclipse Skulls. It's time to go for the Eclipse Skull grind. Get your Zows, Chows, and Super Chows while you're at it to help them make sure that you all got that going. Deposit your statues except for Kachow. I know you want to wait until you have 100% on your snake skin, but I'm telling you, man, it is not worth it. You're going to be losing more gains than you are going to be gaining in the long run. It is not a good investment. Fix your trapping. Your trapping is all over the place. You have your V-Man that's like level 72 and your lowest guy is 22. What you need to do is you need to take your V-Man, build full skill XP, you know, you use uh, use prayer proficiency if you have to pop transfusion, and then you want to place all nature traps for all your characters using your V man. That will give you the utmost XP by far. Your three D prints are atrocious. You literally do not have three D prints. Okay, three D prints are something that unfortunately you can't sleep on, even though how much you hate them, it is just not a choice. You either you either do it, or you just hurt tremendously, and you, it's basically. Not doing 3D prints would be the same as if I take a shotgun and shot my knee. Okay, it, it, my kneecap just blew out of its socket, my whole leg's gone. Okay, you're basically trying to deal with something with only one leg. Don't just do your 3D prints, okay? Don't be legless, okay? Don't be legless, all right? You know what I'm saying? Nobody likes it, but everybody has to do it, right? It's like taxes. 
get tools to at least void tools. There's too many characters that are still using the basic quest items that you get from World 1. Your own World 6, okay? Let's get some void tools. You don't believe on how good stat sticking is. Having, having four tools at void that are stat stick to your specific character is so much extra damage. And not to mention accuracy, you would not be even believe it. Also, that feeds into try one, try two, and try three. And also feeds into your all stat because it's base stats that you get for your tools. So they do scale off the all stat percent. And also get your splicers because your splicers are also another stat stick. This will take you so much time to do. Go ahead and get this done. This should be your next thing. You should be stopped pushing world six because in reality, I don't even know how you're in world six. But that's what I would suggest. Good luck, my dude.